She is my daughter, not yours. I went through hell and back, and sometimes I still walk through hell to be her mom. It was a gift, but I earned the gift and privilege of being her mother. A gift and privilege that I must earn every day that I get to be her mother. So when you come to me and tell me that you want to give her a haircut, I feel indignation, I feel anger within me, I feel violated in my boundaries. Yes, you are her grandmother, and I respect and honor that, but you are not her mother. You had a choice, you had a chance to have a daughter, but you chose an abortion. I don't judge you, it was a choice with consequences, and although I send love towards the hardship that you must have felt to make that choice, and towards the consequences of that choice, the choice was made by you. You chose not to have the possibility of a daughter, but I chose to have a daughter, and I have walked and continue to walk through hell. And because she is barely a toddler, not even two years old, it is only my job and her father's job to help her choose whether she gets a new haircut or not, not yours. So don't come at me telling me you want to give her a haircut. That is none of your business. Hang out with her, play with her, spend time with her, love on her, but don't intervene in my boundaries as a mother. I understand you may not have meant it that way, but it makes me feel like a bad mother, like I'm forgetting to cut her bangs, like I am failing as a mother, but I'm not failing. It is not easy to be a mother of two toddlers. You never got to experience being a mother of two toddlers. You chose one child, and that is perfectly fine, but don't come at me telling me to cut my daughter's bangs. The connection between me and my daughter is solely mine and hers. It is a mother's job to help her daughter mature with joy into her femininity. Maybe you could have phrased it differently, maybe as a reminder, as a question. But to tell me that you want to cut her bangs? No, it is not your job. You won't be cutting her bangs. You don't get to tell me. I am in fear now that you will go ahead and do it anyway when I'm not watching her. But I will be by her side, watching over her and making sure that only I or my husband cuts her bangs. Not because you want to, but because he and I find it appropriate for her and what is best for her.